It's another great day for us. Um, uh, we want to welcome uh, Jared Stollinger uh, to our family. Um, I don't know how this one fell on our lap, but it did. Um, we're really, really lucky uh, to have a high caliber player, um, a great basketball IQ, a big time rebounder, and somebody that's going to come and fill in, uh, we believe, uh, two positions uh, for us that's much needed. When the opportunity presented itself, it was, it was a no-brainer. Um, just playing against uh, Toronto for four years and, and seeing the fans and the city, um, how they back, had their back and, and the support, uh, like I said, it was a no-brainer. And um, I'm so excited. This, this team was two wins away from being into the finals. And um, it pretty much has the same group of guys. And uh, we, we look forward to working this season and, and the support that this, this city has. Um, I would love to make it home. And, uh, and I'm just trying my best uh, to be the best player that I can be, uh, just to help this team uh, win as many games as possible and, and go as far as possible. You look at this young man here, and I, to me, I, I get emotional because um, there's nobody that has done it uh, with more class, uh, more dignity, um, more passion, and this is a blessed day uh, for, the, for the Raptors. Um, for DeMar DeRozan uh, to have one meeting, one meeting, and not have any intentions, this is true class. And I think us as individuals have, have to look at him, the youth have to look at this kid and say, this is how I want to be. I'm so proud that Canada, that Canada has the opportunity to have somebody like this. It's always been Toronto since I've been here. You know, my whole goal when I first got here was to make this whole city and this whole country be known, you know. Um, it's like we always got the short end of the stick. You know, I always took pride and, and passion and, and wanting to change that. To get to a point to where we at now, you know, it makes me that, even that much more hungrier to keep, keep going. You know, and that was my whole mindset of, of taking one meeting. Because I put my blood, sweat, and tears in this organization and, you know, I wasn't done yet. You know, I'm, I'm far from done. You know, I felt like, even to this day, I feel like I haven't accomplished what I want to accomplish yet, you know, and that's just the hunger in me, man. And it's just crazy to be sitting here. You know, I'm going to be back for five, five more years, you know. I am Toronto.